Hey, what up? This is Danny with Plug and Play, and I got a brand new tool for you that allows users to copy images from After Effects and paste images into After Effects, all using your clipboard. This is Copy Pasta. So as you can see, there's two primary buttons inside of Copy Pasta. One says Copy, and the other says Pasta. Copy is used for exporting the current frame to your clipboard, and Pasta is used for pasting what is in your clipboard into your After Effects timeline. So if we want to copy this image, let's select this timeline, hit copy. Now that's copied to our clipboard and we can go inside of any image editing tool or any program that allows you to paste images into, hit command V and it's going to show up inside of there. So this is useful if your client wants a preview of what the current frame looks like and you want to give them an export without having to fiddle around with the render queue and all that. Now you can also render using the render queue if you want a higher definition version of the uh, current frame. So if we check this little box here, go back to our main panel and hit copy again, it's going to export using the render queue and copy that to our clipboard. The other feature inside of copy pasta is the pasta function. So like I said, that allows you to paste what's in your clipboard into your After Effects timeline. So if we go to, for instance, Chrome and we go right click on an image, hit copy image, go back to our After Effects and hit pasta that is going to be imported into our after effects timeline and neatly organized inside of this folder that says copy pasta where all your imported images are going to reside so an instance where this would save a lot of time is if you have a bunch of icons that you need to import into after effects so normally you would have to go and right click on an image hit save image as and then save that to a destination and then import that in after effects but instead if you just hit copy image go back to After Effects and hit Pasta, it'll import that image into After Effects. And so you can just go and click on all the icons that you need, right click on each one, copy image, and then go back to Copy Pasta, paste it, and you can get all of your images imported in After Effects super quickly. Well, that about sums it up. It's a pretty simple program. I hope that you guys enjoy it and that you see how valuable it is in speeding up your workflow. Thanks.